Hey y'all, it's Krista. Um, long time no see. Um, y'all have been keeping me very busy. <laughs> um, especially our newest member of the Mix family, Gina DeLuca. Thank you, Gina, for uh, trying out this One Girl Shows uh, pouring medium. Um, I also want to put a big thank you out to Kathy Carr. Um, you know, Christina Welch sent me um, a jar that she found back in stock of this beautiful paint, um, the Fresh Powder Blue Iridescent Pearl, and Kathy Carr said, I have extra, so I'm going to send you one. Thank you very much. You know that I love it, and I'm going to use it today. Um, so... I'm gonna have Eric get us down to the canvas and let me show you what I'm using today. We've had a lot of snow here lately. It's like a snowpocalypse. So as you know, I'm using the Fresh Powder Iridescent Blue. Thank you, Kathy. And I'm using the Amsterdam Greenish Blue. And I'm using the Amsterdam Grayish Blue in the acrylic ink, awesome color. It's very dusty. I am also using an Art Minds uh, Splash, sparkly. That's this one right here, super pretty. And I'm using the Turquoise Blue by Amsterdam. And my sweet friend Becky Salmon sells these in her shop. This is a Global Colors Pearl Mist. Um, I will put the description, or her website in my description box because this stuff is super sparkle. I love it, and I'm using it instead of white. So um, I'm using no deco arts, no satin enamels, um, the things that normally create cells. So, I'm not sure if I'm gonna want cells in this. I'm using a Fredericks Convexo Canvas. It's a 20 inch. And I'm gonna layer up my big cup. So let's get started. I am going to start with the Pearl Mist. Just a little bit. And because I love what this color does next to white, it makes these amazing, big lacy cells. I'm going to put the Fresh Powder Blue in on top of that. And then I think I'll use the Splash. Put a nice dose of that in. And the Greenish Blue. Very pretty color. And I'll put the grayish blue on top of that. And the turquoise blue on top of that. And then I think I'll do it all over again. I'll use the pearl mist. Use a heavier dose of it this time because whatever comes out last is going to be your outside so you don't need to keep it as tight as you do on, on the inside. I'll put a heavier dose of that fresh powder blue. I love this color y'all. And then the splash. And I think I did this one next. Greenish blue. And then the grayish blue. And the turquoise green, or the turquoise blue, turquoise green. What is it? I'm gonna find out. Turquoise blue. Eric is being my cookie man. I've got cookies in the oven. My granddaughter sells them through school. And, you know, 
Every time your grandchildren say, I'm selling something, of course you're gonna buy, right? So what do I wanna put down as my center puddle? You know what, I think I'm gonna use this pearl mist. Because that's the first color in my cup. Might as well, right? Okay. Now remember, if I don't get cells, I don't care. Because I already know I'm going to wreck this. You know, the, the snow outside didn't stay one way. It went all different ways. I had drifts all over the place around my house. All right, let's pour this out. Let's go. Oh my goodness, I'm watching that pearl mist just come out and it is so pretty. Squeeze my cup, make a finer point. And let's see if I can have a successful dismount. I did. Okay. All right. This is telling you the magic of mix. There is nothing that I used that should be creating cells. Um, but I'm definitely getting them. It's, it's all in the density of your paint and um, how you layer them and how things sink and stuff like that. So um, yeah, that's what's going on here. All right, I think I'm gonna use up the rest of my paints on the edge. Spread that out a little bit. I don't think the cookies are out because I don't smell them. Who knows though? I think I'll put some splash over here. This color is really pretty. I don't think the Art Minds makes this anymore either. It's kind of like the mysterious. But thanks to Gail Bernston, you can totally make it on your own. She has a video that tells you how to do it. I think I'll put this over here. This is that greenish blue. these convexo canvases, y'all. They're so cool. All right, let's use the fresh powder blue over here. I want no cups left. I have a leftover overload over here. I'd rather have really cool skins that I can use than have leftovers right now. Butt that right up. Butt that up. Empty cups, that's my jam. And I'll use this right here. Why not? All right, now everything has, all right, I'm gonna torch this. I'm watching some awesome stuff pop up. Once upon a time I did this video, it's called Long Winter's Night, and I wrecked it with this comb. And I think I'm gonna do the same thing here You 
you don't have to do a lot. But I just think I want a little bit. Just swirl it around a little bit, right? Let's leave the cool stuff. I'm regretting doing what I just did. I may be tilting that off. Maybe not. We're just gonna swirl this around. Open up some of that awesomeness. I want to tilt off some of that blue. So we'll just take it down there and bring it back. And just keep swirling it around. These round canvases are very, very generous that way. I don't know what is making this purple color, but I'm digging the little purple swirls that it's doing. I don't know where that came from. All right, I'm gonna stop it right there because in that blue, I am getting some of the coolest little cells popping up. And it still makes zero sense to me that that's happening because I didn't use anything to drive the bubbles, the cells, nothing. They are driven by just how I layered the cup. Okay, I'm gonna take my gloves off. And wipe the blue paint that I just got on my hands. I'm gonna torch this because I got some sweet stuff going on up here. This is a shimmery piece, y'all. I'm looking at a dog hair. You know. Pick them out now because they become part of the piece later. Okay. All right, y'all, I'm happy. It looks kind of like my backyard. My backyard here with all the drifts and stuff and then how the sky looks and it looks like it has little stars popping out. All right, I'm gonna come get you so you can have a close up. See what I mean about the little stars popping out? It's almost like one of those little Dwight pours or one of Dwight's type of things that I've never been successful at getting. All right, so we'll start up here. We've got some cool cells popping up. Nothing over here is hurting my feelings. That's very pretty right there. See that purple? I don't know what that is. I didn't use anything that should be turning to purple, but I'm kind of digging it. We got cells popping up in here. And got some awesome transparency going on. All these blues. There's that purplish color again. So confused, y'all. Got some nice action in here. And we come down here. All right. I wanna thank you all for joining me today. And I hope you all stay warm and cozy. And I hope you all have a wonderful week. See you all soon. Bye.